I'm going to demonstrate the basic principles uh, around which our electronic speedo works just so you can get an idea uh, of the components and the wiring uh, and how it all works. I've set it all up on our little lathe here. We've got a, a 12 volt battery uh, with a couple of crocodile clips for the negative and positive which represents the, the battery of your car. Um, there's the instrument, the electronic programmable speedo. Uh, this represents, the chuck, the chuck of the lathe represents um, the uh, drive shaft or prop shaft of your vehicle. And I've used three magnets here on the chuck jaws, um, making sure that the, the marked, there's a little red line, the marked face, which is a north pole of the magnet, is facing outwards. And they've just stuck themselves to the metal chuck jaws. There's the sensor, which I've mounted in the tool post here. This is the um, Speedo pickup sensor. I've got it around about a millimetre or two away from the magnets. When the chuck rotates, each magnet in turn passes through the field of the sensor. Right, so here's the wiring. This is the black, the white and the red from the speedo sensor. And these are the colours coming from the back of the speedo itself. We've joined the red and blue together um, because the red is the permanent live and the blue is the ignition live. We've just joined them together for this demonstration and we've joined them to the red on the speedo sensor and we've joined all three to the positive of the battery. There's the black from the speedo joined to the black of the speedo sensor and off to the negative of the battery. And this is the signal input wire, the green one, to the speedo, joined to the white one, which is the signal output wire from the sensor. We programmed the dip switches on the, on the back of the speedo for 2,000 pulses per minute. We have no idea what the actual speed is going to be because we haven't calculated in the, the road wheel size, but that's irrelevant for this demonstration. So here we go. So it works.